Unfortunately, today I have to talk about the first problem I've had with my Toyota Tacoma, which required it to be in the dealership for three days. This is outside the regular service. It's not a 10,000 mile service. It's not a 5,000 mile tire rotation. It has something to do with the manual transmission. If you have an automatic transmission, this does not apply to you. So don't worry about it. This only applies to manual transmission Toyota Tacomas, especially the third gen, because there is a TSB release, which is a technical services service bulletin, which describes how the clutch pedal is failing. Now, when I say failing, the clutch pedal still does allow you to change gears. What is the effect of having the clutch pedal fail is number one, it'll start making these strange noises. When you compress the pedal, it will not be consistent. It will creak. And I wasn't sure what was going on. I was thinking about just adding some grease to the spring to figure out whether that addressed it. But since the truck was under its three year, 36,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty, when I brought it in for the 30,000 mile service, I went ahead and had the service advisor have the master tech look at it. I had a hunch that maybe it was gonna be a warranty issue as I've seen second gen owners and third gen owner manual transmission Toyota Tacoma owners complaining about this issue. Well, lo and behold, I figured out that my truck was gonna be a part of the TSB in which the clutch pedal and assembly would be replaced. I will link in the description below all the parts that were replaced so that you get a general understanding of what is gonna be done to your truck if you experience this problem. Obviously, if you're not experiencing these issues with the clutch pedal being spongy, you don't have to worry about it, but for those of you who are, that are within your three-year warranty, 36,000 mile bumper to bumper, I highly recommend that you bring your truck into the dealership and make the dealership replace it. Obviously, they won't replace it if you're not experiencing any problems, but for me as a owner and having the truck under warranty, I firmly believe that Toyota should take care of something that they made a problem. Other than that, I haven't had any issues with the truck. I simply wanted to make this video so that if you had a manual transmission, you knew, bring it into the dealership, tell them about the TSB, I'll attach all the specs in the description below and have your service advisor replace those parts and get your truck driving to what it was before the problem occurred. Anyways, I hope this helps. Uh, comment below if you have any specific questions for me. Like, share, subscribe. I definitely want to help the Toyota community out, so that's why I made this video, and thank you.